believe me, it's the most important. Because when you wake up, when you sleep, your body starts to get away from the toxins. That's why you have a bad smell. Even when you wake up from, you know, and a sick person is more bad smell. Because the body is trying to get rid of the toxins and bring them, like when you clean the toilet, sorry, or here you clean, you, you know, you bring all the together, no? So it starts to get all the toxins together in your body, in your intestine. So we wake up, the bad smell, it's not from the mouth, it is the gases. They call it methane gas. Toxic. Those are bringing diseases. Bring diseases. Get rid of it. Bring hot water when you stand. Because it's our intestine roll. So you stand, it's help. Only uh, I prefer when you stand in the morning. Now because I do the... Anyway, drink hot water even when you stand, it's okay. You're sitting, it's okay. But in the morning, very important. Do it, you are standing. Don't feel it boring. Have your thermos beside your bed. You wake up, drink. You wake up before you brush your teeth. Before you brush your teeth. Uh, one or two glasses after brushing teeth, if, okay? Uh, at least three glasses of water throughout the morning, you spread, one, two hours. Uh, one glass, 15 to 30 minutes before meal, very important. And we'll see what the scientists talk about, the drinking water, they're not telling drink hot water, that's why I got this discovery. They say drink water, the benefit drinking water before meal. Uh, one to, uh, two glasses at least in the evening, one glass before bed, like uh, half an hour, an hour, because maybe you don't want to be disturbed. Uh, throughout, yeah. And be careful, don't drink hot water. For example, you drink one glass, you wait six hours drink, you'll have appetite. You'll drink too much, you'll be eating too much. So if you feel you have too much appetite, or you could not be able to drink hot water for a long time, like two, three hours, when you feel hunger, before you eat, because you have temptation of eating too much, ask at least a glass of hot water. Drink, then you feel you can control, then you can control your food intake. Because overeating is a problem, eh? Overeating is a problem. And after, it, after eating is good, after eating like uh, 20 minutes, and then yes, it's good, yeah. And then you can spread as you like. Uh, very important, when I say hot water, glass of water, some people were drinking just like this. I got a, a drink, I drank eight glasses of hot water. He showed me, he said like this. When I asked him, you didn't benefit? No, and when I investigate, I come to find the, see, because I don't like the taste of water, so, so they were drinking little, eight glasses. I said, oh, you see, that's why I bring the, Quantity of water is quite a better. This is 500 milliliters. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 50 degree approximate. Yeah, so hot, hot. Yeah, yeah. This is 500. I think all of you have realized. I, is this a fourth glass? Sorry, I didn't go to the toilet. You know why? I talk too much. I become dehydrated. I compensate. So people who do seminar, they end up having migraine or headache. Because talking, 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 you lose water. Yes. So I have to, yeah, I compensate. Yes. I was, at, one time I, it happened, it's miraculous. I was taking, I was in a trip in Oman, it's a 43 degree on a field trip. And uh, I have a thermos of hot water. My colleagues were wondering. Every 10 minutes I drink hot water because it's very hot. And especially when you go in the field. Uh, and I was wondering from morning until evening, I didn't, sorry, I didn't go to the toilet. I didn't pass urine. I was wondering what's happening. My friend said, Faris, we are the one going to toilet. You didn't go. I said, ah, okay. Because it became dehydrated. It's 50 degrees, 48 degrees. So my body loses water. And when I drink the hot water, it was compensating. So, yeah, but sometimes you feel you pass uh, two, three, every half an hour. Don't feel boring. You are removing the toxins. To pass urine is not bad. It's removing, oh, sorry, about also passing motion. Sorry, eh? uh, You are removing the toxin in your body. Uh, result from drinking hot water these are results I found prevent various diseases symptoms, allergies help heal uh, people in pain sickness, allergies and diseases get rid of fat because the key and melt the fat, improve brain memory you become clever and uh, when you walk, you feel your walk performance become nice your boss you say, whoa, what's happening you, be, you, you know, because you perform better your performance becoming better and you earn much better. This is true. Uh, possess a good looking body. Acquire an exceptional personality. Have interest in peace. Respect human rights and reject quarrels. Because you've been touched, you feel you drink the water, not because you are thirsty. Because I want to get you, so you feel the spiritual touch. And when you have a benefit, you feel I have everything. 
It's not that to have money to be happy. Have money is good to ac have access to something. But not every person who's rich is happy. Money we need. But remember, faith is the most important. So when you feel yes, you, are, you are healthy. And whenever you walk, you can earn good. You achieve whatever you want. You are happy. So you want to share with others. You know? Yeah. Uh, that's why Jesus Christ was healing people with water. Because touch, they're feeling touch spiritually. And in Quran, miracles talk about the water and hot water itself. It's been mentioned. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, possible incidents, predictions. Sometimes possible. They call it in UK, they call it uh, brainstorming. Sometimes you feel something will happen, you prevent it. Based on incident. You know? Uh, it's happening in several times. Uh, love of nature and creature. You feel you love everything. You want to share. You love people. You love nature. You love everything. This is true. But within time. Uh, strong faith to God. Drinking hot water, body becomes energetic and event, uh, and, uh, even with the less sports exercise. People, they do too much exercise and then they stop. They got fed up. Then the problem happened. You know, not, uh, but, you know I, I, I do not see anybody who has been doing exercise every day, at least five times a week, for 20 years. They get fed up because, you know, life, many, you are rushing for many things. You do exercise, you stop. You do exercise, you stop. So here, with drinking hot water, just little exercise, it helps you. Because you get the energy itself, it's helping you in your body. This cycle system of the energy you get, of the hydrogen, it really gives you power, feel strong. Yeah. Uh, so, drinking hot water helps cleaning and purification of the kidneys, it removes impurities, kidney stones, like my wife, she said in the hospital, my experience, helps maintaining women's monthly menstruation, and it purifies the blood, the blood, and the blood cells, and the kidneys, and overall body. Because, uh, sorry, some, uh, you know, during the menstruation, we talk about this uh, scientific, uh, everybody to, be, to, uh, to benefit on this. Uh, the, a lot of women they can get temper because the blood doesn't go normally uh, to be removed. And uh, they, it, it affects the hormonal balance of the, they become temper, they become confused. Sometimes it affects them, the relationship with husband, with surrounding society, because they're always temper at the time of the, because it doesn't run properly. When you drink the hot water, it mixes with the blood. It runs very smoothly. And believe me, you feel uh, so relaxed. It uh, neutralizes uh, the hormones in your body. So you feel much better. It has a very good benefit on this. Uh, hot water prevents oste osteoporosis. It's a disease of bone which leads to an increased risk of fracture. Osteoporosis is a bone, uh, when the bone mineral density is reduced. Because when you're in the womb of your mother, for nine months, your, the, bo the bones of a baby become thick. It has a thickness uh, membrane. So what happens? When you don't drink hot water, or water itself, it becomes thin, thin, thin. Your bones become easy to f have a fracture. You get a, what you call osteoporosis. You can have a disease of the bones. Like in your cases now, the bones, pain, all these things. You know, so that's, be careful with that. Uh, so hot water helps. Uh, hot water helps increase of periosteum. Uh, a child's bones heal, see what they say the scientists, a child's bones heal faster than an adult's because a thicker, stronger, and more active dense fibrous membrane, which is a periosteum, covers the surface of the bones. The periosteum has blood vessels that supply oxygen and nutrients to the bone cells, you see? In the baby, in baby, in children, because they got it when in nine months, you don't need to get it also. Drink plenty of hot water, you'll be strong. Sometimes, you know, I feel what I want. I feel, I say, I should go to a two-story building and jump to try myself. Because I feel strong. I feel healthy. Really. And I want to share this. Uh, diseases. Uh, not only one person, not only two people. Hundreds of people get cured with these diseases. Asthma. Hypertension. Diabetes and headache, anemia, series of black, back pain, urinary calculus, that stones in the kidneys, urinary tract infection, uh, high blood cholesterol, uh, tiredness and fatigue, tonsillitis, if you have tonsillitis, it's happening, be careful, drink too much hot water, and be away from the ice, people get to tonsillitis because of the ice, they drink too much cold drinks, ice drinks, be away from those, your body is rejecting, uh, uh, so drink plenty of, and when you have it, drink plenty of hot water, plenty. 
you know, keep on drinking. It will, it will, uh, it will uh, get uh, to normal, it will get healed quickly. Uh, insomnia, lack of sleep. Uh, cold, flu, fever, heartburn, ulcer, constipation, Parkinsonism, hair loss, baldness, like myself. Uh, now it's grown, uh, thanks God. Skin diseases, all kinds of infections. Uh, Alzheimer, heart diseases, cancer, purifying and regularizing women's menstruation. Uh, some of the researchers by Bat Mangalic, he's an American scientist, uh, and, and Downs and Blondes. They say, uh, Dr. Bat Mangalic, they call him Batman. He say, you are not sick. When you're sick, don't say I'm sick. You are thirsty. Don't treat thirst with medication. He's telling you, don't take medicine. Get away from medicine. Okay? It's not for me. An American scientist. You go to the email, check. Who is a Dr. Batman Gilich? Our life, our planet, over 70% of the earth is water. Our, the water is the basis of all life, like Mr. Hamza said, uh, which includes our body. The water is the basis of all life, and that includes your body, 70%. You see what he did, did Mr. Dr. Batman Gilich? He made a research of every organ in your body. He found the muscles which moved your body, 75% water. The blood that transports the nutrients is 82% water. The lungs, which, is, which provides you oxygen, is 90% water. The brain, which is the control center of your body, 76% water. Even the bones, the bones, are, which make us strong, 25% water. So if somebody has a problem with the bones, like our sister, it's because of this. Drink plenty of hot water. Within time, you will feel. Uh, with blessing from God. If you don't drink plain of water, one or two glasses before eating, the, we're waiting for 15, 30 minutes, then the body must borrow the water from itself, causing the followings. If the body, if the blood, if from the blood, the arteries must draw up, uh, I don't need to take all this because uh, maybe it could be quite long. Uh, some are taking notes, okay. Uh, if from the brain you get a dull headache, when you get dehydrated, you start to have a headache drink plenty of hot water. If from the lungs, it causes the shortness of breath. <sighs> you don't have enough, hot, enough water in your body. Drink hot water, which can cause asthma. Uh, if from the muscles, shortness, sh shortness of uh, breath, and uh, you can have angina pain and so on, leg pain, cramps. Uh, if from various organs, it causes pain, abnormal function of constip and constipation. You don't pass, you know, because, yeah. The greatest discovery of Dr. Batman Gulich, they call it Dr. Batman. He said that he discovered that the human body runs on hydrogen. Like car needs a fuel to run, your body needs hydrogen. You get it from the hot water. Okay? From water. And if we don't drink enough water, he's telling water actually. If we don't drink enough water, but now I'm telling you, if we don't drink enough hot water, before we eat food, then the body must borrow the water from itself. And whenever it borrows the water from, that is where you will have medical symptoms down the road. But Mangalich, he got a, 